We chose Forever Platt to end our uh, 14th year this year just because it's one of those great Broadway hit musicals that's a crowd pleaser for everybody. It's a story of uh, a group of four harmonizers back in the styles of the, the 50s and 60s, of the, the young boy groups back then, uh, who just on their way to their first gig happened to get snuffed out. I owe my soul to the company stole. Forever Plaid focuses on one band's journey in the afterlife for one last shot at musical glory. And one of the beauties of this show is it's uh, full of just classic tunes, all the way from Love is a Many Splendid Thing, to 16 Tons, to The Chain Gang, um, to Lady of Spain. So it's just got those old, classic, great harmonizing songs in it. Main characters Sparky, Jinx, Smudge, and Frankie come to life on stage, literally. Their dreams are cut short when they're hit by a bus full of teenagers from a local Catholic school. The band goes on to the afterlife where they get a second shot at music. I think uh, Smudge is maybe one of my favorite characters in, in the whole thing. He's kind of the nearsighted, uh, glasses-toting nerd of the group. So yeah, there, there's a lot of fun character development. There's something that pretty spectacular that happens at the end of the play that, uh, that kind of puts us in, into the mood of, uh, of whistling on our way out, I'll, I'll say. So uh, you have to see it. I'm not going to give that part away. <laughs> Reporting from St. Cloud, Ashley Gertis, WJON News. Uh, hey!